in life when we live with others there is a always a question to do or not to do to say yes or to say no these things always bother very often when we start thinking that somebody has brought something and he wants you to eat you don't want to eat but you feel that no if i say no i say no i don't want that other person will feel bad about it and so you somehow eat it but here what's happening here you are hurting yourself your body is not ready for food but you are still eating to satisfy somebody first thing understand that you in any case cannot satisfy or cannot make anybody else happy in your life to make somebody happy or to make somebody feel that oh you are listening to him is not a right approach better be truthful but truth has to be quoted sugar quoted that also has to be kept in mind after all they are all there around you to make your life more richer better more meaningful they give you lots of experiences in life so they are very much there and required and they are also there to think about you and so they are doing it your mother is thinking about you she is cooking something and she is giving you now saying no should not be at the level of likes dislikes you like something you don't like something mother has cooked some food which you don't like so you'll say no i don't want to eat now this is something where you have to overcome your likes dislikes likes dislikes are your clashes something which is going to weaken you not strengthen you but here is she you have eaten yet she is forcing you eat more eat more you have eaten too less and she puts more food into your plate and then there is a rule in the house that nobody should leave plate like that you have to finish everything which is there in the plate now here there is a dilemma so what will you do you are stomach is already full but you have to finish so don't have such rules in your house or don't force anybody to eat there should be something very clear so one one day if you will leave next day that person will not force you because he knows that you will waste the food so sometimes such experiments have to be done with people with whom you live your parents your brothers sisters your family members be clear that you can eat only that much or you can do only that much and that's it rest share or don't put take only that much you can handle so here be more clear more verbal and if yeah, you have to say no say no all such people who have some health problem very often you will notice that doctors tell very clearly that learn to say no for eating sweet when you have diabetes your neck should move like this and not like this it's very clear but there has to be some reason for it and it has to be done very sweetly saying no is not at all wrong saying no means you know what you are doing why you are saying no you are clear what is good and what is bad for you you are clear and keeping that in mind you are managing someone comes with a invitation that this this is the day you are supposed to come so it is mentioned that what answer you will give yes i am coming definitely coming and you won't be able to go because you have some office work and you won't be able to go so again regret 
instead of that middle path i'll try i'll try my level best and you should try don't just talk try your level best and if you can't go you can't go oh you are going to market get this and this for me i will try keep that if you can do definitely do you can't do you can't do but bluntly saying no i am not going to bring will not help <clears throat> you should not just live for self me my time my work you should definitely live for others and so instead of saying blunt no you can always try if you are successful very fine if you can't can't somebody will be happy if you have done something for him somebody will be unhappy if you have not done something for him but again you can't help <laughs>